North Carolina A&T police say someone vandalized several buildings and signs. This picture shows the suspect walking up to a building before spray painting it. The incidents come two days into homecoming week. WFMY News 2's Giselle Thomas is live after talking with frustrated students. Now this sign looked very different a few hours ago. You can see what's left of a dark green line going through the school name and behind those blue covers, there's expletives and a political statement. Now a local pressure washer company volunteered to help and start the process of removal. And so the solution breaks down the paint um, and then basically you're able to press it off, uh, pressure wash it off. I talked to North Carolina A&T Superintendent of Housekeeping. He says four university buildings and signs were tagged with swear words and political statements early Tuesday morning. Jeremy Mitchell saw pictures online and knew he had to help clean it off. Well, you have so many people coming from out of town and, uh, you know, coming to the game and stuff like that. Nobody needs to see all this. So I, I seen it posted online. So when I seen it, I just knew that I had to come out here and help. University police believe one individual, the person you see here, is responsible for all the vandalism. The person was seen with their face covered, dressed in all black, and carrying a black backpack. Police say the individual was tagging university property while they were patrolling residential areas. Some students say the timing of this crime is disappointing. It's not really doing nothing, really, in my opinion, but kind of just making the, our school look crazy and looking mess when this homecoming about to come up and now we, they have to focus on trying to clean this up before everybody yeah. comes to campus on this weekend. In a statement, university police say the safety and preservation of our campus environment are of utmost importance. Some students encourage others to do the same. We also want to make sure that we can end this, you know, homecoming with, you know, closing remarks, safe remarks, safe. everybody yeah. is safe. cool, everybody is collected. Now the university is asking anyone who can help identify the individual responsible for the vandalism to please come forward. Live in Greensboro, Giselle Thomas, WFMY News 2.